In this video, I'll show you some ways you can improve the quality of a page before capturing text and some considerations to keep in mind as you process your content. I'll do the experiments so you don't have to. Before I start with scanned pages, here's a quick tip for making Acrobat work faster for you. Rather than working from the right hand pane, take a minute and add the tools you need to the Quick Tools toolbar. Right click in the toolbar area and choose Customize Quick Tools. Open the tool set you're going to work with, in this case, Enhance Scans. Select the tool you need, such as the Enhance tool. Click the plus up arrow to add the tool to the toolbar. Click Save to close the dialog. Here's our new tool ready to use. First up, I have a terribly crooked page, something that can happen when you scan. To fix it, click Enhance Scans, Scan Document. You'll see the full Enhance Scans toolbars open. Click Settings. The Filters section shows the status of the available repair filters with the Deskew filter active by default. Leave it selected and click Enhance. When you capture the text, Acrobat redraws the page aligning the text. Always leave the Deskew filter active. The next tool we'll look at is Background Removal, useful for slightly muddy looking pages, but I've got a real test. Here's a page from a book written in the 1600s. The pages are very dark with poor contrast and a darkened bleed behind the letters. I've got one version of my page adjusted in Photoshop to correct the contrast and another one with the background removed. I'll set the background removal to high and capture the text. If I then activate the suspects, and click Review Recognize Text, you'll see some significant differences. In the unaltered scan, the text capture is surprisingly good, although there are quite a few suspects and some unidentified errors. The scan from the page with corrected contrast is far better, both in terms of suspects and missed errors. The black and white scan is useless, with virtually every text string a suspect. The takeaway? Background removal works best when the page has a decent amount of contrast. Next up, let's look at de-screening. Notice on this page that the text is surrounded by little dots, which can occur when you scan newsprint. In the first example, the capture is done without de-screen applied. The capture is too bad, but let's try with the de-screen filter. There really isn't any improvement in the capture. De-screen can't improve this scan, although it may work in some cases. The final filter sharpens text. Here's my starting document. In the first example, I've captured the content without any sharpening. You see the capture is very poor. In the second example, I'll set the text sharpening to high and try again. Isn't that disappointing? Although the text looks much heavier on the page, there's no improvement in the capture. The filter may work for some files, but you can't enhance a poor scan.